Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, peep game. All right, man, I had a chance to look at the Jamel Chalo versus Tony Harrison fight again. Saw it online, saw footage online of the fight, and I looked at it again. And I got to tell you, after watching it two more times, uh, plus looking at a edited uh, version, basically, of the highlights, some of the best parts of the fight, uh, didn't change my mind. I still had Jamel Chalo winning that fight. I still had it. I had it eight rounds to four for Jamel Chalo. And that's just real talk. But I will explain to you why they went with Tony Harrison, why the judges went with Tony Harrison. Now, if you look at the final punch stats, Chalo at least won the battle of you know, the power punches and punches landed. But what kept Tony Harrison in the fight and what I think was winning the judges over was his jab. And he was hitting Chalo with like what you call a power jab. Larry, Larry Holmes had one of them, what you would call a power jab, where basically he could like, like, hit you and do serious damage the jab is really meant to like you know touch you up a little bit to set up the right hand or the hook or the overhand right as the jab is usually used as a setup punch but he was landed that job that jab so efficiently to where it was just standing out his jab looked like a power punch throughout the fight i mean it was like bow it wasn't like boom 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 it was like bow Every time he landed that power jab, it stood out. It looked just as good as a power punch. So I think that's what won Tony Harrison the fight through the judges. Even though Jamel was more active, he landed more punches and he landed the power puncher, but there were just at times, Tony Harrison looked sharper. If Tony Harrison would have let his hands go a little bit more I think he would have won that fight going away because it was apparent he could easily outbox Chalo just like he was doing Jared Hurd and he ended up getting caught he was beating Jared Hurd and Jared Hurd did what he does best he turned it on towards the second half of the fight he ended up catching Harrison and he stopped him so that's how I think Harrison was awarded the fight. Do I think he won me myself? No, I still had Chalo winning that fight. But anyway, let me know what you think. I'm out.